Hello everybody and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3 where we just, it's been a bit, so we just touched the like uh, glass mirror, like water pool thing that is the entrance into Shar's realm, into the shadow realm, shadow fell, whatever it is. <laughs> and uh, so we are waking up in that realm. So get forward, get forward, look forward to that, get ready, <laughs> and uh, I'll see you guys there in a second. I mean, we're all gonna do it, but like maybe with Shadowheart doing it, it would have been better. Four new journal updates. Let's see. Let's see what damage we have wrought. <coughs> yeah, no joke. I was like, the rest of you better be alive. We are in another plane. This is another reason I want to bring Lazelle because she does planar stuff. Well, she did, or she would. She would have maybe if she didn't get like you know eaten alive. Where's the moon plane? Lady Shah. I can feel her all around. This is her domain. This is the Shadowfell. I'm spooked. You did well. Better than I would have Woo! credited you with. Now, hurry along and bear witness to my masterpiece. What are you doing in here? This is the Dark Lady's domain. He does not belong here. Oh, I was flying here. Uh, I was hoping for something. Yeah. Uh, how did you get here? Simple. I followed you. It seems Shah still holds a grudge against General Thorn, and so sought to prevent me from entering in his name. Luckily, you were the perfect agent in helping me slip past her defenses. Now the Night Song is within reach. Uh, stopping me from just killing you and taking the night now. Quite an elaborate setup. Is the night song truly worth it? There is not a shadow of a doubt. But don't take my word for it. Come, see for yourself. Well, maybe Shar should be able to stop you. Like, here. Let's see what damage we have wrought. We left the area before Amalium could help. We need to find the cure somewhere else. I didn't think he could do anything else. Reach the relic. I'm not worried about that thing. The Amalium, he couldn't help me anyway. Cage. Oh, dang it. I can't go back? Oh, maybe I can't go back to Act 1. I was actually thinking about going back to get the blood of Lathandir. Because I figured out how to do it. It was with the grease. Um, but I'm not... I'm not that worried about it. <laughs> it's annoying, but I'm not that worried about it. So, but... None of these got messed up. Interesting. Okay. It's fine. It's annoying, but it's fine. Ugh, it's not fine. It's mo it's slightly fine. Mm, can we just can we jump? It's just the kind of thing you can just. I thought so. <laughs> this is a, a gravityless plane. Why didn't you guys stop the bad the guy? The guy who should not be here. Just a little bit further. See my actions, Lady Shaw. Hear my words of faith. Alright, alright. I guess we could have killed that guy. And, uh, he wouldn't be here now. Witness my adoration. She sounds scared to me. For all her profession of love to Shar. I think Char is a terrifying goddess to love, though, you know? Mm -hmm. Kill her, descend her. What? Eh? Eh? Listen to her kill her. Alright, 
Shadow Hearts having a moment. My face will guide me. I think I'm I'm gonna have Shadow Hearts to keep pushing. Lead on this. Maybe there. Have to keep going. This lady shot in the shadow again. As sure as night will fall. I mean, I like my character being front and center, but as sure as night will fall. But, you know, this is kind of a shadow heart thing. Path interrupted. Maybe I. Like, this is charisma stuff, it's gotta be me. Balthazar, come to add more bars to my cage, or perhaps to lead this would be Justicia's blade directly to my heart. I'm not me, I'm not a Justicia. I invite you. Keep more sins upon your head. My retribution will be all the sweeter for them. All this time, and you still fail to appreciate the gifts I bestowed on you, Alien. Sad to see a thing of beauty not recognize its own worth. But General Thorne, he appreciates you, and he wants you close at hand. So, I am here to whisk you back to him. I welcome the she sight of him cool. after these hundred years. He whose immortality I supply with my very soul. General Thorne. I'm sure you'll be on your best behavior for him, but just in case, I've taken some precautions. Keep back. It will take quite some concentration to secure Aelin for her little journey. Ah, uh, then I can stab you. My song is Shah's sacrifice. She's my destiny. He cannot have her. The night song needs a fairy. Oh, this one. You cannot bind a person to the needs of another. Free her now. We will be doing that. I want to try to ask questions first. The night song is a person. Person? Please. You insult her. You insult me. Aileen. Is so much more. Azimar! She is an Asimar, bound to a soul cage of oh. my and lending her immortal strength to General Form. Her power, oh. his will, my gosh, my genius, an unsurpassable feat. Ramblings most unsane. Poor Balthazar, for maggots ate his brain long ago. Hold your tongue, Aelin, or I'll take it away from you again. I love Asmar. And you, no more questions, no more interference. Um, go on then, take the night song to Catherick, get it over with. Look at me, I'm so excited. Anyway, Asmar, I don't know how you pronounce it. They're one of my favorite races. I actually have like really cool like story stuff in my head. The Oathbreaker I wanted to make was gonna be an ASMR, and I was kind of disappointed in that you couldn't do an ASMR in Baldur's Gate 3. You can get a mod for it, but it's not the same. Um, because I love the idea of being a fallen ASMR, because that's a thing, you can do that and an Oathbreaker at the same time. But like, like I said, not for evil, only because it's like the questioning things, you know? And then it's like, and then you like get like you're torn in half between like this like, like divine and like devilish impulses you know or like entities almost like pulling you apart buying for your soul you know um i actually i'm gonna go back i think and i'm gonna do i'm gonna do the oathbreaker one because that would at this point like that is why I became an Oathbreaker. That's why this character kind of became an Oathbreaker. Is like, you know, she questioned and she questioned and like, I don't know. Not necessarily that. Maybe it's kind of morphed into that where it's like, 
you know, she questioned things and she did what she thought was right and was abandoned. And then it's like, I no longer wish to be bound by these arbitrary rules that this deity has created or this like group of deities or whatever, you know? And so it becomes a, um, a freedom thing. Not necessarily like, woo, freedom. Like there is, there is, there is sometimes sorrow in freedom and being pulled away from that which you knew, a security, even if the cage was gilded, it was your sense of security. And so, I don't know, there's like, it's not just like, whoa, everyone, we're not, and in this world you can't deny the existence of gods necessarily, but you can deny them you, which is I think the best you can do in this world, you know? The night song is Shah's sacrifice. She's my destiny. He cannot have her. You cannot bind a person of the needs of another. Free her now. Person? Okay, Please. here we go. You insult her. You insult her. So I get the ASMR info Amy too. Is so much more than that. How did he say it? She is an Asimar. Asimar. Her power. Ramblings most. Hold your tongue, Aelin. Or I'll take it away from you again. No. And you. No more. She's no no more interference. If she's the reason Catherine Form is invulnerable, you're not taking her, leave, or you're a dead man. Or do I want to attack him? But I don't want to be if she's the reason Catherine Form is invulnerable. It's like it's more like I don't want her to be stuck in this and I don't want to kill her. Yeah, we can attack him. Fly at me, you fool. You cannot stop what is to come. Let's see. She only has one health. This is bad. Apostate Destroyer. Can we push it? I don't know. I, I am totally down to do pushing of these guys off. Yay! Ha <laughs> ha! Like there's, there's too many for me to be picky about this, you know? Let's try. Try for a bit. <clears throat> Let us make short work of this. I need to do. He's technically undead. He is undead, so Shadowheart can't do her turn undead thing. Oh my god. I knew these guys probably wouldn't turn, but I was hoping they would take damage. Alas. Miss? Why? I was gonna say... We gotta get off the edge! Oh no! Wait, someone just got you! To... No! Run! Actually, okay, let's see if we can't we can't push back. Huh? You have nothing I want. Away with ye. Apostate librarian. Haha! -ha. <laughs> what? What? From where? <laughs> what? Jeez! I cannot conjure the woodland being. We need. We need somebody else now that Lazelle's gone. gonna be so tough. I don't know. I don't know about this one. Sleep on my 
There are so many of them. The druid's gone already. Jeez. Halson's inspired by what? Uh, Outlander. Reach Night Song without having been affected by the Shadow Curse. Okay. It could have erased the dead. Got 60 XP for <laughs> fell to a lethal blow. What did she? I don't know what she did, but she did something. Yeah, let's um, can I do the aura. Oh, I don't want to break the tentacles. I think. I mean, that guy moved. Maybe I do want to break the tentacles. Jeez. Oh my gosh, she needs to get out of there. Ooh, dang it! Oh, the cloud kill sucks. Okay, let's revive. I think we can throw these without killing somebody. It does do bludgeoning damage though, so I'm like not sure. A little help, please. No! No, guys, I was so close, I got rid of most of the mobs. Uh, also, the new, um, um, the new video quality is like, I have like a really high, and it's taking up so much space in my, I have to keep stopping after like at least an hour, like at max an hour rather, and then like moving it over to the external hard drive <laughs> because the video file is so big. I'm like, ah! <laughs> Also, let's kind of keep in mind, being a former paladin, maybe seeing an ASMR, as much as the ASMR person might not appreciate it, might be, again, one of those, like, oh my gosh, like, this is a, like, a semi, sort of divine being, you know, and, like, you'd have to, like, struggle with that a little bit, and it's an outbreaker, like, like, one that wasn't, I don't know, one that didn't leave necessarily angrily, right? It's not like, I'm not like, everything, all religions suck, you know, there's nuance, you know, and, like, there was like, there's still always, like I told you, like with the bittersweet with like Halston and, and Carlac both being kind of wild nature people, you know? It's like this like draw and like bittersweetness to it, you know? But this ASMR woman looks like she'd break us all in half. Sacrifice. She's my destiny. It looks like she'd, she cannot have her. she'd break us all in half if she could. So she's probably not like, especially after 100 years being here, probably not the happiest person. <laughs> this time, we run from the edge. Oh my gosh. Lazelle's encumbered because I think because I kept sending her stuff. Oh, shoot. Nice! Clack, clack. I don't like that. They're all kind of, they're having to kind of go through Shadow Heart. Ah! This is bad, though. That cloud thing sucks so much. I think I just need to focus on him, honestly, and I need to not focus on anybody else. Uh, okay, well, let's have you transform then. Okay, but we are outside the cloud kill, I think. Oh? Yeah, they were all standing too close to Shadowheart. That's nice. Um, I'm just gonna have her yeet herself. Oh, she can't. There's no yeeting her. Ow! Dang it. She has no more Misty Step. Wow, she's mushed that guy. Ugh! With haste. Okay, I 
I'm disengaged for the first time ever. You guys proud of me? Misty step. No, come on, please. Get up here. At least you don't have to die. Okay. You think striking down my will be the end I mean maybe not, but like Get on out of there. When I go. What? Oh, he has the freaking Oh no, okay, I was like, did he just save like on like a death saving thing? But he did not. going so poor. We're like so close all the time. Okay. Well freaking I know we still have all the rest of everybody else to deal with, but freaking at least we don't have to deal with the freaking guy with the stupid cloud stuff that I hate. What is she she's like outside Indomitable. Oh, sweet! Okay, yeah. Saved on the blindness. I didn't realize that would be a reaction. I thought it would just happen, like, behind the scenes. Hopefully with her being up here, they'll try to attack her and not me. Ah! <laughs> Can I have a health potion, please? No, don't. No. Okay, well at least I took one out with me. <laughs> I guess why I did it why I did a three. Cause I was like, that better work. Take you. Ooh, baby. We're holding on by the skin of our teeth. Okay, now you. Yep, half crunch, crunch you go. Razel is a force of nature, truly. Now we just have this one guy left. Come on, can't stay on you. Yeah, well, you just need to take a nap. You, you go, you go, you go back here. I was like the shadow heart guy. No, she just lost um lost the guard. She, she kept it up for so long though. I'm very proud of her. Oh, oh my gosh. Alright, well. Hold on. Let's, uh, let's, um, let's do some F5-ing up in here. Especially because if I don't get to loot, unconfirmed character changes, we're not safe. I don't know what that means. Oh, can we bring... We should bring... What's his name back? Where is he? Is it there? Still alive. So, that's progress. Was it... Alright, okay, I'm sorry, Smar. I will... Uh, or Aelin, whatever your name is. Come down. I am close to my limit. Yeah, well, let's have... What's her name here? Do this. That's better. Something, and we'll do a short rest. Yes. Alright, first I'm gonna loot because I'm paranoid. Oh, where's that guy? He died, like... Maybe his body just... I, th I thought he died up here. There he is, okay. I was like, maybe his body didn't stick around? I don't know. 
circlet of bones. Allied and damage assistance are resistant to bludgeoning, slashing, and piercing damage. Soul cave research. Rambling knows in a spider jagged hand filled with volume, they speak of a soul cave fighting a life force of one of of one of that to that of another, a crew drawn to a shoot figure side by side. The one on the left appears to have a dagger protruding from its chest, while the one on the right has a corresponding wound in its own chest. Someone with a dagger. I don't think I need that particular dagger for so whatever's gonna happen. I thought she had a mark on her chest, but I don't know. What's inside? I think it would be Kethrick who would have the mark and she would have the dagger. Alright, I'm not I'm not seeing much else on these guys, so discussion. And with that, we'll go ahead and cut it off there. Uh, I know I keep saying it, but in some episodes, there are just a lot of things that kind of happen all in a row. And we are definitely ramping up to the end of Act 2, so get ready for some pretty big reveals, some uh, quality of life changes. <laughs> and uh, yeah, thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, including my Acorn Tier patrons. Thank you so much, Fane, for your support. I very much appreciate it. And I want to give an extra special shout out to Reese Galito, my Sapling Tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. I very much appreciate it as well. And I want to give an extra, extra special also shout out to Christopher, my forest tier patron, who has truly gone above and beyond in his support of me and the channel, and who I cannot thank enough. So thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.